Two songs, then we on. Y'all know how we do. We got his new teeth coming in, High Fever. Had to, I had to tend to him, like a good dad do. Main event. Enough of that. that song called Back Jumping by me. Now, this ain't by me. It's by my man Shay Davis, but I'm only going to play the hook. And I'm going to jump right on this nigga head. <laughs> I ain't never been a good nigga, your neighborhood street cat. And I'm only saying that because I really did the street cat. Your neighborhood tough guy. And I'm only saying that because you would really get snuck in your eye. Your neighborhood hood nigga. You hear me? Your neighborhood hood nigga. You hear me? I don't know why you wasting your energy getting mad. I just finished eating. About to get some hair relaxed. Take a chick to the woods near the farm. Y'all ready? When I'm humping my chick outside, getting mosquito bits on my arm. Cool it. Huh? I'm gonna let this hook play too. That I mean, it's gonna count as well. Smack was good. This is my shit. This is Shay Davis, man. My guns will brand. Don't fuck you in the head, clap the shit out of the man. Put up OTF only the fam. Pull him out, knock him back, and make them things go grand. This is the shit I would do. Don't fuck you in the head, clap the shit out of the man. Put up OTF only the fam. Why you there looking all sloppy on. on the side blocks in New York? See, it ain't worth you getting hit with them things out the clip. So be real cautious of the things you say out your lip. All that's nothing to get you hit and hurt real bad. Slapping your neck, wrapped up in a plastic bag. And the more go cold on your big toe attack. It's Shay Davis, man. This is my nigga Shay Davis. <laughs> if y'all if y'all wasn't fucking with Smack, back when Smack DVD was in their prime, you ain't gonna know you ain't gonna know who my nigga Shay Davis is. This is Shay Davis, man. My gun go blam. Gun butt you, smack you up, smack the shit out you, man. <laughs> Shay Davis get on them tracks and talk that motherfucking, that gangster. Shay Davis get on there and talk that bullshit. Yeah, I, IG uh, Zero Nig. He said that nigga stay shaking his fist. Listen. Okay, we gonna jump right on these niggas' heads, dog. We about to jump right on these niggas' heads. We about to jump right on these niggas' heads. Because this is serious. This shit so motherfucking... Let me tell y'all something. This shit so motherfucking serious that I'm not even... Listen. This shit so serious that this shit is scary, my nigga. This shit getting scary out here in these streets. Listen here. This nigga is like raising weirdos from the grave. Okay? Now... We gonna go through the whole motherfucking, the whole interview, okay? But first, I'm gonna just get straight to the broccoli and the beef. But we gonna go through the whole interview, the peep game. So, 
uh, and don't turn me petty. You can clarify this if I if I'm incorrect or if I don't got anything right. I don't know if don't turn me petty is in the chat or not, but you know later on if you see this later, uh, what you call it? Uh, you know, clarify it on your IG. But this post right here that I'm about to show y'all, okay, y'all see that it say posted five hours ago. But don't turn me petty just reposted this post. Oh, excuse me. Eight hours ago. Excuse me. Don't turn me petty just reposted this though. See? Now let me give y'all the story behind what I'm about to go in on. Now the post was originally made some days ago. Okay? And uh, this little weirdo. Okay, Nature Boy been basically grooming this little weirdo for some time now. I don't know if it's been a year, two years, but it's been some time. Because I went to the nigga Instagram to see who this nigga was. And I had blocked the nigga a minute ago for trolling me when I was going in on Nature Boy Heavy. So this nigga definitely is a Nature Boy weirdo fan. Now why is this important? This mother, this is what happened. And this is why I'm about to blank on the nigga. Well this is part of the reason why I'm about to blank on the nigga. Okay? So the nigga admits to, if I'm not mistaken sexually molesting his three-year-old sister and cousin over a time period, right? Now, the nigga 17, he say this shit happened three years ago. He say he knew what he was doing. He say, you know, he didn't know what it was like to, I mean, he, he was enjoying what it was like to have power over somebody, right? Same weirdo shit Nature Boy be on. And I'm finna make a point before I blank on both these motherfuckers. So this is where this is where I'm this is why I'm about to break this nigga back. Okay? The nigga who said this. Not even just Nature Boy. Now click now, don't turn me petty can clear this up. The mama can clear this up. Whoever can clear this up. So I guess the mom says that the nigga matter of fact, let me send this screenshot to myself so that y'all can see. Cause y'all know we on our we do heavy research. We we find out who a nigga is real quick. So I guess the mom said that. Uh, she, she gave Don't Turn Me Petty a fake name for whoever this was and, and said that, uh, she was going to do a live with Don't Turn Me Petty. If do, and so I guess Don't Turn Me Petty deleted the page thinking that the mom was going to come clear up whatever. And I guess, I mean, deleted the post. And I guess after Don't Turn Me Petty deleted the post, then the mom deleted her IG and went ghost on Don't Turn Me Petty. So what I'm getting from this family is, because the nigga said out his mouth, okay, and I just emailed it to myself. The nigga said out his mouth that he told his mother and his and his uh and and his aunt, if I'm not mistaken, okay. Boom. Okay, they said his name was Tyler. Okay, that's that's what the mom said his name was. Now this the nigga YouTube right here. The nigga YouTube say his name Abraham. Okay. Now, I don't know what the nigga name is, nor do I give a fuck. All I give a fuck about is them, is is what's going on in that house with them kids. Because if this nigga say he, he over there actively molesting kids and the motherfucking mom and the aunt ain't do shit, we want to know what happened. We want to, if this nigga just got on live, this nigga just got on live and told Nature Boy, a.k.a. the world, that Nature Boy made him comfortable to admit this shit. And so this is why the shit getting crazy. Because Nature Boy... Listen, let me remind y'all in case y'all forgot. Every nigga over there with Nature Boy is either a homosexual or a pedophile. Okay? Nature Boy is making it... Okay. Nature Boy is trying to make... He's trying to give weird old niggas a comfort zone. Okay? So let me just make that clear. Okay? Musa over there. Said he sucked his cousin dick. Trying to sexually experiment. Okay? The other nigga over there. The light-skinned nigga. I think his name Wise or whatever the fuck his name is. That nigga said he raped his two sisters. On, when he said he came in, I was drunk and raped his two sisters. Okay? The other nigga over there, Solar. Gay as a motherfucker. Allegedly. Okay? So everybody over or Every last nigga over there. Uh, the nigga Tron. Tron said... He, since he been over there with Nature Boy, he been feeling like he want to have a homosexual experience, okay? Then the one young nigga over there, that was over there, talking about he feeling homosexual. So, the vibes over there is very weird, okay? 
But now let me make you, let me, let me, let me tell y'all why this is going to be important. Because this is the, see, y'all forget that I've been told y'all Nature Boy was a pedophile. Y'all forget that I blasted this nigga. Let me, let me, let me, let me show y'all. Because before I go in, I gotta, I gotta retrace my fucking roots. I did this goddamn video in July of 2018 on the nigga. This shit had damn near 100K. This the same video where the nigga said he let his son play with his penis. I did this video on Nature Boy. August 2018. This the same video where the nigga said child molestation was good and it was spiritual for children. You can go watch both these videos. This, and then the nigga also said that women was ready for sex as soon as they get on their period. So Nature Boy been letting you know what type of time he on, okay? And so what he trying to do now is he's trying to spiritualize pedophilia, okay? That's called Okay, that's that's called motherfucking nigga. You might as well be a motherfucking Satanist. The nigga is trying to create a, a spiritual doctrine as a blanket cover. Okay, as a motherfucking blanket cover for his sick ass agenda. This nigga ain't no different than a motherfucking Catholic priest. This nigga ain't no different than than any other weird ass nigga who want to touch on motherfucking kids, my nigga. And and I'm a I'm a. I'm going to go in on the commentary of this motherfucker, okay? Because last time I went live, I told y'all, somebody just said in the comments, I was going to say it, this nigga made a joke about jacking off to his own daughter and feeding the baby semen. I ain't making this shit up. So now you got another nigga who Nature Boy feel like, oh, I mean, who, 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 who Nature Boy has made this nigga feel comfortable, like it's okay to be a pedophile, to the point where this nigga has molested his own sister, his little sister, and his little cousin, okay, and then came and told Nature Boy, and was and was and felt like that shit was okay. And so one thing that this nigga forgot, okay, and I don't know if the nigga 17, 18, I don't give a fuck how old the nigga is. All I can say is, nigga, you lucky, you lucky, you ain't do that shit in my motherfucking house. You lucky, you ain't do that shit in my shit. But all I can say is this, nigga, you not over there with Nature Boy. You in Babylon, dumbass. Nigga, it's consequences. And so I want to, I want to, listen. I want to know, and I probably will never know. I want to know. Did the mother and the auntie take the proper motherfucking precautions and steps to do right by their ch children after their son told them that he molested them kids? Because motherfucking, um, before I play the video and go in, I want to say this. He said he told him. He said, I confessed it to my mom and my aunt. So I feel like the mama and the aunt, since they tried to, uh, I mean, excuse me, since the mama tried to finesse Don't Turn Me Petty to take the video down, I feel like she trying to motherfucking hide it. Now, I don't know what happened or what she did after she did the situation, after she was told that. All I can do is speculate. But from what I'm seeing, I feel like he told her that and she was more worried about motherfucking being embarrassed or whatever than seeking justice for her motherfucking daughter and, and, and her motherfucking, uh, excuse me, and the other family member involved. And so with that being said, I'm a, I'm a blasting nigga. Nigga, I'm going to have your face on the internet, nigga, because we don't play shit like that. I'd rather you get on this motherfucker and say you caught three homicides. Nigga, I would, you wouldn't hear me say, you going to get on it. Nigga, you think. You think, you think, nigga, we about to let Nature Boy resurrect all the weirdos out of the ground? Nigga, we waiting on him to go in the ground. You think we about to let you niggas think it's, bitch, it's, it's let me tell you something, little boy and Nature Boy. It's real niggas still out here. Just because we don't give a fuck to pay attention to you niggas, that don't mean we gonna let shit slip, slip, slip through the motherfucking cracks, my nigga. Ain't nobody watching. It's just like motherfucking LGBT community. Nigga, I don't give a fuck about what them people do. I don't even think about them. But when they get to trying to put that motherfucking, that P on the back for pedo, pedophile, nigga, you got my attention. And so, it's real niggas out here still living. You think you about to just get on the motherfucking internet and say some shit like that and niggas not gonna light your bitch ass up? Nigga, you crazy. So allow me to, allow me to reintroduce myself, Okay. Allow me to let y'all nigga reintroduce myself. 
and, and remind you motherfuckers of who the fuck I am on the internet. See? See? See, let's go. Now, I'm going to play the whole interview in a minute, but right now, I'm going to just get straight to the meat. Listen to the nigga. Listen. About that is a good thing. And the fact that you know... Pause. The nigga whole shit still getting worse. Nigga, nigga, nigga whole lip about to fall off. Nigga got her by V. Nigga whole motherfucking lip finna fall off. But let's keep it moving. But if that was wrong, is a good thing. Listen. And I want you... Let me go back. Listen. Here we go. About, like... I just was why, doing why that. Did, I was doing that just to get off on my slate. You're that nigga. He said he did it just to get off. Now let's keep it moving. Not even because it was just a child, but just that I was doing something sexual, and then the fact that I was being mischievous about it. Not even just because it was a child, but the fact that I was being mischievous about it. Let's keep it moving. I felt like I had power over them. He felt like he had power over a fucking three year old. Let's keep it moving. I felt like I didn't have power within my own self. He felt like he didn't have power within his own self. Let's keep it moving. So I, I used and took advantage of that. But I, So he took advantage of that. Owned up and I told my mom and my aunt about it. You heard that? He said, but I owned up and I told my, my aunt and my mom about it. Now now let's go. Because I felt so bad. I'm like, that's fake of me to sit here and smile in these people's face. And I know what the fuck I did. Years later, I told them. Are you older? Older. Are they older now? Three years older. They, they turned me sick. See, he just said they both turned six, so they was three years old when he did it. Let's keep it moving. Did your finger go inside their anal? This nigga Nature Boy asking weird ass questions. See, see, this is my he asking shit that that no real nigga gonna wanna know. Wait a minute, why you ask that nigga? Did your finger go inside their anal? Why you wanna know that? What kind of weird? When the nigga said molested a kid, that's all I need. I don't need to know the details, nigga. I don't want to know the fucking details. Now watch Nature Boy keep asking weird ass questions. Watch this nigga. This is how you know this nigga's a sick, demonic ass nigga. This nigga asking the nigga. This nigga asking. Yo, I don't even want to repeat the questions this nigga asking. But why you asking these detailed ass questions, my nigga? What kind of imagery is you trying to get in your fucking mind, weirdo? You fucking weirdo. Now watch. Let's keep it moving. He asked the nigga. He asked the nigga that weird ass question. Now listen to this nigga. Yeah, but it wasn't. I wasn't like my whole finger. It was like. So the baby, so the baby didn't cry. Why are you asking this nigga? Did the baby cry? This nigga, Nature Boy asked the nigga. So you stuck your finger in the baby anal? This nigga said, "Yeah, it wasn't my whole finger." Now, now any nigga, any real nigga response would. Let me flip it back to me. Any real nigga response would have been, "Nigga, get the fuck off my life, nigga! Before I come beat your fucking ass." Nature Boy talking about, so did the baby cry? Why? Why do it matter if the baby cried? I'm going to tell y'all why he want to know if the baby cried. Because he, he want to try it. He want to try it. And he want to know what what's the risk of him. Listen, I wouldn't be, so, listen, I said this shit on my last live. When Nature Boy said, when Nature Boy made the joke, and I'm going to play it so don't nobody say I'm putting words in his mouth. When Nature Boy made that weird ass joke, okay, about jacking off and feeding his own child semen, okay, I said, I said, I pray that Nature Boy is not around that baby alone and is not around that little girl by himself changing her motherfucking diaper because he's a fucking weirdo, okay? Now let's keep it moving. Let's keep it moving. Listen. No. He said, no, now watch this nigga. Oh. Wow. Wow what? What's wow about that? What's wow about that? Now listen. I really, you know, I, I, I give you so much respect. Wow. Now look at this nigga. Now, now listen to this nigga. Listen to this nigga. Listen to this nigga. I said it. Everything I said months ago coming true. I said it. Everything that's happening now, I said it. All the way down to the point where I, I'm a listen. I'm going to keep saying I told you so. All the way down to the point where I said, Nature Boy is the type of nigga that will touch on some kids, and them women over there is the type of women that will let him do it. I said it. I said it. I said it. Now, when it happened, I don't want I don't want nobody running to me talking about, oh, did you hear about Nature Boy been touching on his own motherfucking dog? Because I'm, all I'm going to say is, bitch, I told you. I told you. But let me flip the screen back. Let's go. Listen. Because I see... And this 
about like listen about that is a good thing and the fact that you know that that was wrong is a good thing and i want you to know that you're forgiven and you don't and i'm so glad you're able to talk about this openly look at this nigga who is you to tell somebody they forgiven who the fuck is you he not forgiven who the fuck is you to tell this nigga he forgiven this nigga ain't forgiven shit bitch this nigga we don't forgive that that's unforgivable let me tell you something Bitch, that's unforgivable, okay? Let me remind you. Touching the kid, unforgivable, nigga. Unforgivable. Bitch, I wouldn't give a fuck what you do, nigga. That's that's an unforgivable act. Kill a motherfucker, forgivable. Rob a motherfucker, forgivable. Uh, Steal some shit, forgivable. Tell a lie, forgivable. Rape a motherfucker, negative. Rape a child, ne- Nigga, you might as well, nigga, you might as well catch your motherfucking self before we catch you. You raped the kid. You did what? Over a long period. It ain't like you bust a move one time. You was, you knew what you was doing. You just said you knew what you was doing. You just said, I knew what I was doing. I just liked it having power over them. So you molested your own motherfucking sister and your own motherfucking cousin, both over a period of time. You said three years went by. You started when they was three. They six now, nigga. And you gonna call another pedophile and think he got the power to motherfucking forgive you? Nigga, you not forgiving, nigga. You're not forgiving, nigga. You not forgiving. Who the fuck is you, nigga? Who the fuck is Nature Boy? To be talking about something you forgiving. He's a fucking weirdo, too. That's why he got sympathy for you. That's why he got sympathy for you. Because he on the same shit. Now, I want to say this before I play the whole... No, first of all, I'm gonna play that shit Nature Boy said. So don't nobody think I'm, I'm putting words in his mouth. Then second of all... Okay, I'm going to play the interview and I got one more receipt in between. But I just want to say this to the mama. Okay, what did you do after your son? If anybody know this motherfucker, please let us know. If anybody know this motherfucker, if you if you out there on the the, the, the Internet world and you know this motherfucker, you need to ask this nigga and his aunt. You need to find out who the motherfucking who who the who the little cousin is. He talking about what aunt he talking about. And ask them, do you know this nigga been molesting your motherfucking daughter or your whatever? I don't know the sex of the boy. I mean, or the cousin. I'm assuming here. But do you know this motherfucking nigga is on the internet admitting to molesting your motherfucking kid? And the mama too. And ask the mama, what the fuck did you do? What did you do when this nigga told you he has been molesting your motherfucking, your kid? What did you do? What did you do? What did you do? What did you do as a parent? Man, listen. I, man, listen. And I don't even believe in whooping kids. But that's the day when I might have to... Man, listen. I wouldn't give a fuck if you was my kid or not. I wouldn't give a fuck if you was my kid or not. I wouldn't give a fuck if, it, if you... I know he said it was more than... uh, more than Okay, it was a little boy and a little girl. I knew it was a, I knew, it, I knew one of them was a boy. I mean, one of them was a girl. I didn't know if the other one was a boy. But we, we finna watch the whole video right now. But I just wanted to say this. If, if a motherfucker, listen, I don't know, maybe I'm different. I don't know. I don't have that much love for nobody to think you gonna get away with that. Not even my own motherfucking mama. Not even my own motherfucking kids. You did what? They don't even got to be our kids. They don't even got to be our motherfucking kids. They could be somebody else's kids. You molested who? I'm finna fuck you up. I'm finna go to jail. Like, you better tell me some shit like that and take off running up the motherfucking street while dialing 911. Because I'm fucking somebody up. Whoever house it happened at, I'm fucking you up. Okay? And this is the nicest way I can say it. I'm fucking you up. The nigga that did it, nigga, I'm about to, nigga, I'm about to take a motherfucking hammer and knock your motherfucking kneecaps out your motherfucking legs. And then I'm going to tie your motherfucking, bitch, what? I'm about to, it's about to get real crazy. You did what? Nigga, they going to find your ass in a abandoned house somewhere like a pretzel. Nigga, I'm a motherfucking, nigga, I beat and took your leg and stretched that bitch behind your head and duct taped your motherfucking foot to your face and just baseball batted your ass. For three motherfucking hours. Straight, real talk. You did what? <laughs> nigga, we about to... T- bitch! 
Bitch, I'm about to, what? You did what? Nigga, I'm about to tie your motherfucking ass to, the, to a motherfucking chair like this and motherfucking blowtorch your motherfucking chest, nigga. You did what? What? Nigga, you fit, nigga, it's torture city. You did what? Nigga, what? I can't even fathom. Nigga, I beat and tied your motherfucking ass like a mummy and just left your feet out and just put a motherfucking lighter to your toes, nigga, and just burnt your motherfucking toes, nigga. I beat and hung your ass upside down and got three, three motherfucking, three dog fighting pit. I need three grand champions. Nigga, I'm going to the most dog fighting this ring I could go to. Nigga, we about to get these niggas two stacks. Two stacks for 30 minutes of service from them dogs. I'm about to let them dogs tear your ass apart while you hanging upside down. Nigga, I will. What? Bitches torture city. Like, that's when that's when the whole, that's when the charge go up. You don't even just catch no assault. A nigga did what to my kids? Uh, assault. Assault. Nigga, we passed assault. Nigga, we on some Saw 7 shit. We on some Saw 5 shit. Assault. You did what to my motherfucking kid? I'm not even saying nothing. I'm not even calling 911. A motherfucker just gonna be looking for you. You gonna be on the news. Like, have you seen my motherfucking kid? This nigga went to school and has not came home. Have you seen this nigga? And this nigga gonna be... Nigga, we gonna be doing all kind of shit. We gonna be making shit up to do. I'm gonna be making shit up to do. I'm gonna be making shit up to do to your bitch ass. You do some shit. That's unforgivable. I don't give a fuck what a nigga tell you. Do not let a nigga get on the internet and act like... Uh, molesting. Nigga, what? Nigga, what? Nigga, please. You better fuck with the... You fucking... Apparently, y'all out there fucking with the right people, kids. Y'all out there fucking with the right people, kids. As you should be. As you should be. Because you you know the state and fuck away from the... Front. I'm not the one. Bitch, I seek revenge. I seek vengeance. I seek vengeance. And I'm not scared of no motherfucking sale. Nigga, you did what to my motherfucking kid? Oh, I'm going, bitch. I'm going for show. I'm going... I'm going, nigga. I ain't high and shit. Pull up in this motherfucker. The torture weapons is right over there. It wasn't me. Same nigga that kidnapped him kidnapped me too. That's my alibi. I'm thinking what? Listen, you crazy as fuck. You talking about you about to be molesting kids over three over three years span, and 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 and, and you forget and you and you having a real nigga moment. A real nigga moment with this weirdo is gonna forgive you, nigga. You crazy as fuck. And I'm sorry if I'm going off on a tangent. I'm finna get back to these receipts. But this shit is blowing my motherfucking mind. This shit blowing my motherfucking mind. Mama, where's where's this nigga mama at? Where the fuck is this nigga? Where the fuck is this nigga mother, man? What did you... I'm, yo, I'm amazed. What did you do, mama? Before I play this next receipt, let me put some more of my motherfucking... Damn, I didn't put too much, too much in my goddamn hand. Before I play this motherfucking receipt, I just want to know... What the fuck did you do when your son told you he molested y'all his 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 younger sibling, aka your other kid? What did you do? Did you call nine one one, bitch? Did you call CP, bitch? What did you do, bitch? God damn! I know what you did. You swept that shit under the rug, kept that shit a motherfucking secret, and it would have stayed a secret too. Had this dumbass nigga not got the fuck on the internet with another dumbass nigga thinking that he was cool and said some dumbass shit like that. Because Nature Boy made it cool to be a fucking pedophile. And so I'm here to let both these niggas know. Nigga, that, that pedophile shit not cool. Okay? Nature Boy, I see you trolling. You can keep trolling, nigga. You know I don't respond to you, nigga. You's a fucking lame. But this... We not, nigga, we not opening no doors for that, my nigga. We not opening no doors for that, my nigga. And why you calling my name, bitch, if you want to come on here and explain to us, okay, why you said this weird ass shit about jacking off to your daughter, you're welcome to do. So, I know you in this live watching. Nigga, you want to come on here and explain to us why you was asking that nigga? <laughs> you want to come here and, and, and explain to us why you was asking that nigga detailed questions? About how he molested a fucking child? Do you want to come over here, nigga, and explain to me why you made a joke about jacking off and giving your own daughter your semen, nigga? See, you trolling. Bitch, ain't nobody playing with you. Who playing with your weird ass, nigga? You Gotham City ass, nigga. Now, let me flip this up. Let me play this before, so I can, get, so I can get, get greasy. Let's go. Listen to the nigga Nature Boy. 
Y'all was coming through me. Like, all I heard was like, hand milk, coconut milk, almond milk. Grass milk. I'm like, yo. Just jack off and give me some cum. <laughs> and they laughing. You heard the nigga just say, just jack off and give me some cum? Why would you play like that? Now, now, now I'm, I'm about to play this video right here, right? Cause this gon' this gon' seal the deal. Listen to this nigga. See that, but deep Listen. down I knew that I was attracted to some guys, you know. Now, now this the same nigga who said he molested his his two siblings. Now he talking about he he bisexual and he's done homosexual things. So I'm showing y'all the pattern behavior here. Listen. I still feel like I'm sort of confused in a way because it, it's weird, you know. I, I don't like a guy that's masculine like me, you know, but. It is what it is. See? I had sex with a guy. You hear him? He talking about he had sex with a guy. And now he now he talking about he watched tranny porn too. Since Nature Boy talking about he watched tranny porn. Listen. Yeah, I'm not ashamed to say I am who I am and it is what it is. Master Chief explained it and articulated it. Look at him. Master Chief explained it in a Master Chief ain't explained shit, nigga. In a way that made me feel more confident about myself. He was See? like shit. If I was bisexual, he saw it as having the best of both worlds, for, you know, and that's how I see it too, so. Nature Boy told that nigga, if he bisexual, is is having the best of both worlds. Leave that, but. You hear this weird ass nigga? So I said I'm bisexual. He bisexual. I I'll be watching transsexual transgender porn and he watched transgender porn. Shit. It turned me on. But it, you know, she can't look like a man. I don't she she whatever you want to call it, the trendy she, she can't look like a man. It's not gonna turn me on that way. Look at him. She can't now 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 mind you, this is this is this is what these is the type of niggas nature boy producing. Now let me tell you something. Nigga, if you homosexual, I don't give a fuck, nigga. Do you? Do you? Do you? But th this nigga right here? See, this is my thing, right? When you grown, you make your own motherfucking choices, my nigga. If you like the same sex, male or female, and you grown, nigga, sh do you? Do you? I'm not out here blowing whistles telling motherfuckers how to live their life. I just live mine the way I choose to live mine. But touching on kids... Nigga, please. Nigga, please. Because an adult can make a choice as far as their sexual preference, whether we agree with it or not. But when a child cannot, my nigga. You out here, this nigga out here molesting little boys and girls for over for, for, from, for, for three motherfucking time he started when they was three. And now they mother now they six. And and you on this motherfucker talking about nature boy said you can have the best of both worlds. Nigga, you better be lucky. Nigga, listen. You lucky, nigga, I don't know them kids and you don't live next to me. Because I will fuck you up. I don't give a fuck if you're not 18 or not. That shit don't... I wouldn't give a fuck if you were 7 years old. You would get punched dead in your shit. Molesting some motherfucking kids as my neighbor. Nigga, you can't live on the block. It's a dub, my nigga. It's a dub. I wouldn't give a fuck who your motherfucking... I wouldn't give a fuck if, if your whole family was stone cold killers. Nigga, we got to get it on. Then nigga, tell them bring them pistols. You're not living next door to me if you touching kid. Nigga, you crazy. Is you crazy? Is you motherfucking crazy? And then after, because I still ain't even get to the fucking interview yet. But with that being said, nigga, you still, I mean, where the fuck is the parents at, man? Where the fuck is the parents? Where is the parents at? How is this nigga just bopping around? This nigga living in the same, I'm assuming you still in the same house as the motherfuckers you victimized. Come on, my nigga. So, so I feel like right here, this is one of them moments where mama might have swept that shit under the rug. Because I don't, I'm hoping that the whole family ain't that trifling to where the whole family know this shit was going on in they motherfucking family member's house and they didn't do nothing. Okay, I'm gonna show y'all the nigga Instagram too, cause I had to block the motherfucker. Okay, I had to block that weird ass nigga a minute ago. Okay, let me show y'all the nigga IG. Let me go to the. Let me go to the. Let me take it to the roots. Okay, here we go. 
Here we go. Let's go. Now, this is this lame-ass, dusty, dirty-ass nigga. Now, watch old boy come in. Hold on. That's the warning cry. I want you to know that. Beast Jesus. Fraction, what's going on? Man, it's twisted. Yo. Squizzite. My man, they got that. Hold on, let me go back, because this nigga shit popped up. Let me find it. That's the warning cry. I want you to know that. Beast Jesus, Fraction, what's going on? This nigga name who? If y'all know this nigga Instagram, put that shit in the in the motherfucking comments. If not, don't turn me petty. Know the nigga Instagram. Man, it's twisted. Yo, squeeze it. My man, they got that. I don't, I don't really know about um what the challenge was. I just was tuning in, seeing everybody asking questions and stuff. But I was kind of afraid to say this, man. I, um, like you know how people try to demonize you when they say shit about you. That's that's harmful and mean. You hear this nigga? You see how people try to de demonize you and they say shit about you that's harmful to me. See now he trying to uh, now he trying to appeal for sympathy from a from a motherfucker who can understand him, which is another motherfucking pedophile. See, see, what you mean? Shit that's motherfucking harmful and motherfucking mean. Bitch is motherfucking true, nigga. That nigga said that he would. That nigga made a joke about jacking off. And giving his motherfucking daughter his semen, nigga. That ain't harmful and mean, bitch. That's true. The fuck is you talking about? Now let's keep it moving. You you gave me a lot of courage, man. You gave me courage to slay my own demons, and I don't want to turn it into one of those kind of towns. But I know you're not the people that how they portray your shit, man. Cause I done some things, and you helped me to. You hear that, nigga? I know you're not the way that motherfuckers portray you to be. Cause I did the same shit. I did the same shit. Let's keep it moving. And, and, and fight my own demons. Like I said, it's kind of hard for me to say this, but I'm scared right now. Like, I'm not gonna lie. But I wanna know. He's scared. You should be. Damn, I don't even know how to say this. I don't even know how to say this. I've, I've touched a child in a, in, a, in, a, in a, um. Run it back. He said, I've touched a child. Listen. I've touched a child in a, in a, in a, in a um. He said, I've touched the child in a negative way. So what? That's not who you are. So I know that that's not who you are. See? From one pedophile to another one. Let me run it back. Because ain't nobody going to say, Pharaoh, you putting words in. Let me run it back. I've, I've touched a child in a, in a, in a, in a, um, a, a negative way. Like, so I know that that's not who you are. So I know that that's not who you are. Because I did the same shit that you said you did. But I look up to you, and I don't want to accept motherfucking responsibility for what I did. So I'm a, I'm a dick ride you and say I know that that's not who you are, because I know that that's I mean because that's not who I am. See, let's keep it moving. I see, I see who you are, and I know that you're a pure-hearted person. And I, and I know that you're a pure-hearted person. I wanted to know, like, what well, I was putting together why I would do something like that. Because I was young myself. I'm, I'm only seventeen right now. How old, how, how, what was your age? See, now he, he, he asked a nature boy for, for, for advice on what made him want to do that. And nature boy really about to try to get this nigga some advice because it's shit that made him, that make him still want to do that. When I did that um, Let me tell y'all something. Let me flip to me real quick. That would have been the start and the end of me and that nigga conversation. As soon as that nigga would have said I touched the child. I would have been up on my motherfucking... I would have been this close on this motherfucking camera like, what, what's happening, nigga? You did what? Repeat that shit? I would, yo, I would have went off on that nigga like, you did what, my nigga? No, nah, nigga, go, yo, I would have been like, yo, who at your house with you? Do they know? I would have been like, yo, nigga, go hand that motherfucking phone off, nigga, to whoever in the house with you, nigga, because we need to talk, nigga. I need to know. Do y'all know this nigga? He would have handed that phone off to his mama. I would have said, listen, mama, no disrespect, motherfucker. You live right now. It's over 300 motherfuckers on the live. My name is such and such. Listen, this nigga just got on here and said he touching motherfuckers around there. What's happening? What's happening? Because we need, we need you to shut it down. We need you to shut it down. We need you to shut it down. Y'all motherfuckers, man, bitch, what? Bitch, I wouldn't have been on this motherfucker talking about, well, how old were you when it happened? I would have been like, nigga, what? Nigga, you did what? I would have flamed that nigga. I would have flamed that motherfucker whole spirit out. 
I would have been like, nigga, not, nigga, go right now, nigga. Walk through your house and hand somebody the phone. I don't give a fuck if they're younger than you, nigga. Hand somebody else the phone, nigga, so we can get to the bottom of this shit. Straight the fuck up. But let me keep it moving. Let me keep it moving. See? See? And and, and a lot of niggas going to say, well, Pharaoh, you know, why you lighting this nigga up? Because y'all worried about Pizzagate. Nigga, Pizzagate is out of your reach to stop. But this ain't. See? See? This ain't. You don't worry about I don't I don't worry about shit that I can't that I can't I don't worry about problems that I can't solve. I worry about problems that I can solve. See? Y'all niggas so busy worried about the white man, the white man. Look at these niggas right next door. Doing worse. Doing worse. Doing worse. Doing worse. I have never consciously, and I do mean consciously, met a white person physically that I know. To be doing some shit like this. Now I've seen shit on TV. I've seen documentaries. We know all about Scientology. I've exposed a lot of motherfuckers. I have never personally had a conversation. With a white person. That I know has touched a kid. I've had conversations with niggas. See. So I'm not worried about the shit that I can't stop. I'm worried about the shit that I do have the power to try to stop. Okay. Period. And so this motherfucker right here. These two niggas right here. Go get these niggas. Please go get these niggas. But let's keep it moving. Let's keep it moving through that. Let's keep it moving. It was more than once. So I knew what I was doing. You heard him? You heard him? It was more than once. So I knew what I was doing. Listen. Um, it was more than once. So I knew what I was doing. But now I want to show y'all something. As this nigga is telling probably one of the most disgusting crimes that you can tell somebody. This nigga Nature Boy does not look shocked or appalled at any point in time. This nigga, this nigga, this nigga looking like, well, well, nigga, me too. <laughs> this nigga not even, this nigga ain't, this nigga, listen, let me run it back. This nigga facial expression did not check. Let's go all the way back to when he first said he touched the kid. Let's see Nature Boy's face. Look. I know that you're a person, and I want to, listen, I've touched a child in a, in a, in a, um, Negative way. Like, Look, no motherfucking sympathy, no no empathy for the motherfucking child. The nigga eyebrows is raised. When somebody raised their eyebrows, that's a and uh, when you when you study in micro expressions, that's a physical uh, ex expression of body language which suggests interest. This shit, this shit peaked that that this nigga told Nature Boy that he motherfucking touched the kid. And this shit piqued that nigga interest. Look, look. So I know that that's not who you are. Look, he I came close it. to the camera. Look, he came close to the camera. Listen, y'all got to study body language. That nigga came close to the camera and, and, and got focused. Like, ooh, let me hear this shit. Look. I see who you are. And I know that you're a pure hearted person. Look. And I wanted to know, like, well, I was putting together why I would do something like that. Look. Because I was young myself. I'm, I'm only 17 right now. But... It was more than once, so I knew what I was doing. But I didn't really know. Like, I, I was never, my intentions never was to hurt anybody. I was really just curious. I was insecure. I'm still kind of insecure. I wanted to, you know, I don't you know. You don't know the exact age? Now, look at Nature Boy. You don't know the exact age? Why you want to know, nigga? Why do it matter? Why the fuck do it matter? Why you ain't telling this nigga to get the fuck off your line yet? Huh? That's the, that's what I want to know. Let's keep it moving. Nah. But I was older than 12. He was older than 12. Yeah, so I knew what I was doing was fucked up. So what? what how old was the child? Look, now this nigga want to know how old the kid was. Shit. It was, it was more than one, yo. Now you hear this nigga? It was more than one. That nigga just admitted that he molested multiple children on fucking... Look, look. It was more than one. I'm not even going to lie. Let's keep it moving. It's more than one child? My yep. What happened? What he, he said my own child? family. Look, the nigga said my own family. Listen. My own family. What happened? My own family. 
Let's keep it moving. Well, it's like, um, now, Nature Boy, tell me about what happened. Let me let me flip it back to me real quick. Let me flip it back to me real quick to show you what Nature Boy did. He he creating a picture in his mind. How old were you? How old how old was the kid? Okay, now that I got a mental perception of the two parties involved, what happened? Fill in the details. Nigga, what the fuck you need to know all that for? Why would you want that in your mind? My nigga? Why would you want that in your mind? I'd have told that nigga, what? Nigga? I'd have said, bruh, what city you said you from again? That was the that was, I said, what city you said you from again? And nigga, that's all I would have needed there. Nigga, we need to contact everybody you motherfucking know. And let them know what the fuck you been doing to your own family. Fuck you mean, nigga. How old you up? What happened? Nigga, I don't need to know what happened. I don't want to know what happened. That's the police job. To find out in detail what happened. And try your ass in court. Bitch, I'm not the motherfucking... I don't give a fuck to know the details of that. You said you did what? That's all I need to hear. Keep that other shit out, out my brain. I don't even want that shit in my consciousness. But let's keep it moving. Let's keep it moving. Look at this nigga. Pure interest. Pure demon. Now look. I, there was babies, right? There was, there was like two, I believe. And I was... Like what, what age? The babies was two. The babies, the babies was, two. was two. They was two years old. They was two years old according to him. Listen. Really were, they, were they walking? Were they walking? Yeah. Or they walking? Why you asking this nigga was they walking? Yo, this nigga, why is this nigga asking these motherfuckers? Why is this nigga asking all of these goddamn questions? Why is these niggas, why is this nigga asking this nigga all of these weird ass questions? Was they walking? Why do it matter? Why do it matter? Listen, I didn't even think of that. I didn't even think of that till now. Like, damn, was they walking? Why? What kind of nigga want, needs to know that? I didn't even give a fuck to, to think to, about knowing that. Why, nigga? What what kind of weird ass de definitive description is you trying to get in your fucking mind? Okay, let's keep it moving. Let's keep it moving. Yeah, they was walking, and, and it was it was walking. Yeah, were they boys or were they girls? One was a boy, one was a girl. One, what? Look, one is my little sister, and I feel so messed up. I really do. One is his little sister, and one was my cousin. I understand that. And one was his cousin. So he molested his younger sister. And he molested his boy cousin. Yeah, I understand that. It's okay. Yeah. Um, let me ask you this. You're that nigga nature boy talking about it's okay? That's not okay. L look. I understand that. Yeah. I understand that. Listen. It's okay. Um, let me ask you this. Nigga, that's not okay. What's okay? That's not okay. Let's keep it moving. What what did you do to the to, to the children? What you do to them? What did you do? You, so you said you were 13, so you were cognitive. Yeah. Now, I just want to say this before I, before I play the rest of this tape. At no point in time, <laughs> Jay Versace said, bitch, let the video play. Listen, Jay, I, this shit, I got to keep jumping in here. This, I got to keep motherfucking blowing the whistle. Let me say this before I play this shit. At no point in time did this nigga come on there to tell Nature Boy the details of what he did. I heard what he said. He asked Nature Boy to help him understand why he might be thinking or feeling the way he's feeling as a fucking pedophile homosexual. Nature Boy is, cur is, is currently, in this video, doing everything but that. This nigga is taking the time to pry into the motherfucking description. I mean, t is, is he's trying to pry to get a goddamn description of this event. What's wrong with this nigga, man? Yo, it's some scary niggas on it. It's some spooky niggas in the middle of nowhere. Listen, this shit crazy. This shit crazy. They said the pen comment is the wrong IG name. It is the wrong IG name. That nigga, that nigga name underscore underscore something with a T. Don't turn me petty, Noah. Ask don't turn me petty. What'd you do to them? I just put my finger in their butt, honestly. Fit. Look at this nigga. And it fit. <laughs> Yo, this shit crazy. Look, this nigga, this nigga said some shit I'm not going to repeat. This nigga said he did some shit with his finger to the little kids. 
And Nature Boy's question is, did it fit? Listen. Yeah. What did you do to them? Listen. I just put my finger in their butt. No okay. I, look. Did it fit? Not really, but yeah. Uh, why you do that? What made you do that? Why you want to know if it fit, my nigga? Why you want to know that? Bruh, why do you want to know that? What's, yo, you, yo, this shit crazy, man. This shit crazy. Why do you want to know that, bro? Why? Did it fit? Nigga, what the fuck you mean, did it fit? Nigga, it ain't supposed to be there. It ain't supposed to be there, nigga. It ain't supposed to be there. What you mean, did it fit? It's not supposed to be there, motherfucker. Yo, nature boy. N nigga, see what's happening is your whole motherfucking, yo, you just, yo, your essence is, is spilling out and you just can't stay shape shifted. And now you just exposing yourself so much more on your own than anybody outside you had to do. So much to the point where you making it comfortable for, for other pedophiles to come on your live and confide in you for guidance of why they think the same way that you do. You sick ass nigga. You sick ass nigga. Let me run this shit back. Let me let me I mean let me keep this shit moving. Let's go. I was insecure of my own self. I thought I wasn't ever gonna get no nobody my age to fuck with me. And all my friends around me was having sex. Did the children cry when you did that? Look at this nigga. This nigga said he did it because he thought that he couldn't get nobody his age. But the nigga, Nature Boy, is still focused on the kid. See, 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 I want to I wanna get y'all to understand this. He's trying to ask Nature Boy for mental health of why, he, of why he thinks being a pedophile is okay. Nature Boy is still stuck on trying to get details of the act. Let me run it back real quick. Look. I was insecure of my own self. I thought I was ever... See, he talking to Nature Boy right now about, about why he did it. And this nigga, Nature Boy, still asking sick-ass questions. I don't get no, nobody my age to fuck with me. And all my friends around me was having sex. Did the children cry when you did that? Why? Why do... Nigga, why? This nigga like five for... This nigga like 20 for 20 on weird-ass questions. Did it fit? Did the children cry? How old were they? Was it candles lit? Like, nigga, whoa. What the fuck kind of questions is you asking? What the fuck? What you mean? What you mean, dude? What do you mean did they cry? Bro, what's wrong with you? Let's keep it moving. Let's keep it moving. Only nigga asking questions like that is a nigga who either, who either did that and got a different result and he's surprised that at the results this nigga got. Or a nigga that's planning it and he want to know what to expect. You not slick, nigga. No. But it was just a quiet, like, they knew something was wrong. See? Were you curious about, like, I just was why, doing why did, I was doing that just to get off on my slight. Not even because I was just a child, but just that I was doing something sexual. And then the fact that I was being mischievous about it, I felt like I had power over them. I felt like I didn't have power within my own self. So I, I used and took advantage of that, but I owned up and I told my mom and my aunt about it because I felt so bad. I'm like, that's fake of me to sit here and smile in these people's face. And I know what the fuck I did. Years later, I told them. Are you older? Like, are you older now? Three years older. They, they straight. And remember, Nature Boy got molested when he was a kid. Okay? He was a victim of child pornography. So I want to put that out there to let you know the type of mind state this nigga got. Let's keep it moving. Did your finger go inside their anal? Yeah, but it was Look, this nigga Nature Boy brought it all the way back. This nigga Nature Boy brought it all the way back. Mind you, before I play that part, I'm going to keep narrating this shit so y'all don't miss a beat. Nature Boy is once again trying to confirm with this nigga the details of this sick moment. Nature Boy just asked the nigga again, did your fingers go all the way in their anal? Nigga, didn't he just tell you he did that? Didn't he just tell you Less than five minutes ago, that's what he did. Why is you asking this nigga again to repeat the shit that you know he did because he just said he did it? Why, nigga? What the fuck wrong with you? Now, let's keep it moving. Look, listen. Look. Did your finger go inside their anal? 
Yeah, Eyebrows up. It wasn't like my whole finger. It was like, show this baby. Shit, the baby didn't cry. No. Um, I really, you know, I, I, I give you so much respect because I see. And this was when you was, this was when you was like 13, 12 years old. I even was questioning, like, why would I do that? And what was in my mind that made me so curious? Do you have those thoughts still? Like, being honest. Well, to, no, not with the type of kid, but just to, just to be honest about what I did do. Because I know that that was wrong, and I would never do it again. Right. So I just want to let you know that you're forgiven. Look at Nature Boy. This nigga said he'd been molesting his little sister and his little boy cousin multiple times over the years. And this nigga, Nature Boy, talking about after that whole story, this is Nature Boy's response. I will never do it again. Right. So I just want to let you know that you're forgiven. You're forgiven. That you don't have to, you don't have to beat yourself up about that. The fact that you felt bad about that is a good thing. And the fact that you know that that was wrong is a good thing. And I want you to know that you're forgiven and you don't, and I'm so glad you're able to talk about this openly and to be able to, um, you know, be man enough to come out, come out, come out and say it. And, I'm, and are you saying that I gave you that heart to do it? You did, man. You it was See? questions and shit that I like. You would just say it, and it resonated with my heart. Like, so no matter what anybody. See, Nature Boy gave him the heart to admit that he too is a pedophile. My family say about you. No matter what anybody else say, I know I, I, I can see my the, the better self of me and you. That's why. I, so you, know, you were able to heal through. You were able to heal through that situation and admit that that was wrong and that you did that. Yeah. But so many people yeah. carry that around in their chakras, and I know. there's so many people out there have done stuff to somebody or they have to do stuff that something has done to them, and they don't say nothing about it. But the fact that you know that it was wrong, and you understand why you did it out of curiosity, you were stupid, and you know you just knew. Insecure. Are you? Mm -hmm. Have you been with a woman now? Have you been with a woman now? Yeah, I actually okay. was testing out sexuality. I'm like, shit. I'm in high school. Might as well have sex with what? Well, uh, shit, it was fun. Okay, pause. I'm done. I don't want to hear the rest of that interview. Nor do I give a fuck to hear the rest of that interview. Hold on, y'all. Instagram kicking me off. Come back. Come back. Hold on. Instagram kicking me off. Come back. Come back, y'all.